Hello, good morning. Uh, thank you everybody for coming. Yeah, and initially I wanted to look into why Tiger's scalability, but then I knew that uh, if I'm uh, going to talk about RocksDB, so I added a little uh, RocksDB to my uh, research uh, tool. And uh, besides the CTO and the Percona, I'm uh, a fan of uh, uh, performance uh, topics and uh, uh, performance is not uh, only uh, uh, for uh, fan, I think uh, performance is uh, important uh, uh, because uh, uh, if we understand how system uh, perform and how can we make it more efficient, again like uh, uh, Islam said we can do more uh, with uh, less and uh, at the end it's always uh, about uh, money, how we can be more efficient with hardware, how we can use less uh, hardware with uh, uh, in getting it the, the same uh, uh, performance. So uh, in my uh, research uh, initially I used the uh, Sysbench. We recently implemented Sysbench for uh, MongoDB, which is uh, available from our uh, GitHub. So uh, if you would like to uh, uh, play with it and uh, repeat my experiment, you, you're welcome to uh, to use this uh, Sysbench. And the uh, Sysbench is a, a micro uh, a synthetic, uh, synthetic benchmark, uh, which use uh, uh, only uh, primitive uh, uh, operations. It's kind of a very simple and very easy to set up and run. Uh, but uh, we uh, found uh, it's, uh, uh, this benchmark is valuable and because uh, operation we perform is kind of building block for more uh, complex uh, queries which you, you usually run uh, against the uh, database or, or MongoDB uh, particularly. So, uh, uh, since batch operation we have uh, two big modes, uh, read-only and uh, read-write. And the read-only performs uh, read queries such as like, like uh, point for cup, uh, range queries, uh, uh, some aggregation and the uh, uh, distinct uh, operation over a uh, data set. And for uh, read-write operation, we uh, add some uh, modify operations, like uh, uh, modifying an index field, uh, modifying index field, and uh, uh, we're trying to emulate a certain delete row, which is easier to do with uh, uh, MySQL when you have transactions, and with MongoDB, we are trying to use find and modify uh, operations which are supposed to be automated in uh, uh, MongoDB. So we, with, uh, this, uh, uh, we try to keep uh, uh, in short delete uh, in the content that you kind of uh, do, uh, uh, do not change your si size of your data set. You keep your uh, data size uh, uh, the same uh, all the time. And uh, 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 sometimes uh, I hear complaints about this uh, bench that uh, really doesn't uh, represent uh, any real workload, and uh, that's uh, uh, true. But again, keep in mind that uh, runs uh, very simple elementary op operations, which are building blocks for more uh, complex operations. And uh, I would say if uh, we usually see some problem in this uh, bench workload, usually. Uh, there will be a problem also in uh, 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 real life. So if you find some uh, and uh, identify some issue in the system bench, most likely uh, someone uh, will see this issue in, the, in in production. But of course, reverse is not true. If benchmark runs well, it doesn't mean necessarily that your production will uh, uh, run well or, or also. So for uh, my uh, benchmark, uh, uh, which I show uh, later, I use uh, this uh, uh, hardware. I use a 56 cores uh, uh, blade uh, server with uh, 256 gigabytes of uh, RAM. And I use uh, a client and server connected through 10 gigabit. Uh, uh, 10 gig, not gigabyte, 10 gigabit uh, network. And um, uh, I use uh, uh, three uh, different kind of uh, storage for this setup. And I use a uh, very basic uh, uh, Samsung uh, 850 SATA uh, storage, uh, which kind of initial consumer grade, uh, currently uh, rated about 500 
uh, dollars per, per terabyte. Then uh, I would say uh, uh, medium range uh, server grade, which uh, uh, you can get for your uh, server production usage, is a Samsung 863, which is not uh, uh, actually not, not not much expensive than the uh, first one. Uh, I found that you can get it about uh, 600 dollars per terabyte. And uh, uh, one of the uh, recent uh, Samsung releases. Uh, high-end uh, uh, SSDs, uh, which is NVMe uh, version, uh, PM7025. Uh, again, high-end and uh, uh, about as twice as expensive as previous one. But uh, still, it seems a uh, big progress comparing like five years ago where you, you would get high-end SSD for 10 uh, grams per, per terabyte. So I uh, appreciate this uh, progress in storage. And uh, my uh, uh, benchmark setup, uh, I use uh, a collection with the 60 million uh, row feature, which gives about 100 gig gigs of uncompressed data. So you see uh, when we use uh, all memory, uh, that the data actually do fit into memory. And uh, I uh, vary threads from uh, uh, one to 1,000 to test test scalability. Uh, storage engine, I will test uh, uh, Wire Tiger and uh, uh, Mongo Rocks, uh, Rocks DB implementation. And uh, to, to see how um, uh, engine performs in uh, memory restricted environment, I uh, going to change uh, uh, case uh, cache size from 4 gigabytes to 200 gig. So uh, you see in some uh, one extreme, uh, we will, will have very small cache size that uh, 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 all operation will uh, uh, will use some kind of uh, I/O operation, or we will use a very big cache size where all data will fit into into memory. What's uh, important uh, to keep in mind in this case is that we that both WireTiger and the RoboDB they use the operation uh, system cache, so that they actually to, to limit to really limit the memory usage you need uh, some kind of additional restriction and I use uh, C groups uh, from uh, uh, Linux to, uh, to limit uh, uh, memory usage for, uh, for uh, each uh, uh, engine. And uh, uh, now uh, uh, let's talk a little a bit about expectation for each engine. That uh, Wire Tiger is a V3 based uh, there are uh, LSM version of uh, Wire Tiger, but I don't think it's uh, uh, well documented and uh, recommended to use by uh, uh, MongoDB. So uh, we will use only B3 implementation. And the B3 uh, kind of uh, uh, it has uh, uh, usual properties of a B3 engine. It usually comes with uh, fast uh, reads, uh, but also it is known for uh, slow random writes, especially when data exceeds memory. And Mongorovs, like uh, uh, Islam explained, it's uh, uh, LSM3 based, and it, uh, it is known for uh, very fast, um, very fast random write, but it might be uh, slower for a read. That's kind of a, a typical characteristics of B3 and LSM3 engines, and that's, uh, that was my expectation before uh, starting the, uh, my expectation. And uh, there are also uh, different ways of how we can look on uh, uh, scalability. That um, we we can uh, use a multiple user threads, uh, like from one thread where only one uh, uh, user in, in the system to very uh, high intensive, high concurrent environment with a thousand threads. We can uh, increase memory uh, uh, from a very small memory where, uh, where all workload is. Uh, some kind of higher workload to a very big memory when uh, data fits into memory. And uh, we, can, uh, uh, we can use a storage with different uh, performance characteristics that we kind of can uh, scale uh, our storage system. And uh, uh, also uh, a usual way for uh, MongoDB to scale out to use multiple servers, but uh, uh, I will not uh, cover it uh, in this uh, uh, experiment. And a little bit about my uh, typical benchmark methodology. I don't uh, produce single number. I usually run uh, some longer experiment and uh, do measure measurements 
every 10, 10 seconds and uh, we, we measure throughput and the response time every 10 seconds. So it helps uh, you to see uh, trends, uh, what's going on with the performance uh, during the benchmarks and if they sign up some kind of problems or uh, stalls uh, during, uh, during an uh, uh, experiment. And uh, to, to cover uh, a lot of experiments, I use shorter uh, runs, like five, 10 minutes. And uh, uh, I will vary the threads from one to a thousand that the carrier has uh, size from four to 200 gigabytes. And uh, it's uh, usually produced a lot of uh, data points. And uh, uh, my view on the benchmarks is that a single number is not uh, or quite interesting, but it was interesting to see it on some uh, trends, uh, uh, how system performs uh, e, uh, uh, as the uh, time uh, goes. So um, to present, uh, uh, to present uh, uh, different data, I use uh, different uh, graphing techniques like uh, scatter plots, trend lines, glitter uh, uh, box plots. So uh, just uh, to, uh, to, show, uh, uh, to, to show you how I present data, this is a typical uh, scatter plot graph, uh, which uh, uh, on uh, uh, xx uh, we um, uh, show time as time goes for uh, 10 minutes with 10 seconds interval, and uh, uh, on uh, uh, y uh, x we um, uh, can see the throughput how throughput uh, varies uh, in time. We see some uh, jumps. Uh, and drop scales. And we can uh, add some line that we can see the system, how the system dynamically performs, uh, performs in time. Uh, but uh, uh, that uh, does not give you uh, some kind of a summary. So to provide a summary of run, uh, I use also jitter plots uh, or box plots. That's, these are techniques allow you to see actually kind of the, the description numbers of uh, uh, experiment you can see density of results and you can uh, estimate the minimal and the maximal value or and also a median so in this case uh, it's kind of hard from all scatter plots to get a uh, uh, median but with box plots you can see that the median uh, throughput was a little less than three thousand transactions per second all right, and uh, now uh, let's, uh, let's go uh, to uh, results, uh, what I have. The first one is a uh, read, uh, read only experiment again, and I use different cache sizes. And uh, a small, a small uh, in the case with a small cache size, uh, it uh, shows ability of engine to handle uh, growing data. The smaller cache size, the more uh, pressure uh, will be on uh, uh, IO reads. Uh, but the big uh, cache size shows how the engine uh, uh, is efficient in the with internal uh, data structure. And the use cases for read-only uh, uh, read workloads, if, uh, say if you have some, uh, 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 some kind of uh, reporting server, then you can uh, um, batch uh, reporting. Or if you have some read intensive components, which I consider like a blogger, wiki, journal wiki, is more um, uh, read intensive uh, or write intensive. Usually you have a lot of readers uh, and writers in this uh, system. And usually if you see some problem in uh, read only uh, scalability, uh, it usually uh, signals some internal design problems, like uh, 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 overly protective access to some shared uh, data structure. Now, uh, now uh, I will uh, show you some results. I uh, propose you don't uh, read much in numbers right now. My slides will be available, uh, 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 totally open and totally available, and you will be able to uh, uh, to analyze and uh, uh, summarize uh, data with your own pace. The uh, uh, takeaway from uh, the graph that uh, I show uh, under different threads uh, as we increase the uh, uh, memory cache size, how uh, engine uh, scale in uh, read on the workload. And the blue uh, line is uh, ROCKDB and the 
orange is a wild tiger, and uh, mm, uh, 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 for, from this uh, results you can see that uh, a wild tiger uh, scales much better in uh, Arizona liver colors, and uh, that again it was expected from my uh, initial summary that a wild tiger is more designed for uh, faster uh, uh, faster breed. And uh, uh, if we uh, let me actually skip it. this one, you will be able to take it from most, uh, my slide. And uh, uh, this uh, results for uh, faster uh, uh, storage, uh, Samsung uh, 863 uh, type of. So uh, 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 take away uh, with uh, more uh, memory, uh, uh, wild tiger, uh, 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 wild tiger with more memory is able to perform uh, uh, more uh, uh, read transactions uh, uh, per second. And uh, that was uh, scalability on uh, data uh, on the cache size. And now uh, I uh, going to show uh, how the uh, engine scales with uh, under multiple thread overflows and all data uh, uh, fits, into, fits into memory. So uh, uh, we, uh, uh, we see that with, with more threads, both engines kind of uh, scales uh, quite well. There is, uh, I don't see a significant uh, issue there. A typical up and a little down, let's say, typical for uh, all, all uh, databases. And the takeaway is that uh, we see uh, uh, scalability up to uh, 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 56, uh, uh, 68 uh, threads. Uh, and the uh, wild tiger again performs in uh, read only uh, scales uh, better than uh, 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 ROX did. So uh, to, uh, to summarize my uh, uh, read-only uh, uh, experiment, that, um, I would say both engine scales uh, reasonably uh, well on, uh, on read-only, and the white tiger benefits from uh, more memory, and it uh, scales uh, well with increasing threat. And the white tiger uh, seems more suitable for read uh, intensive workloads, and if you can uh, cache uh, a lot of data. Uh, now uh, let me go to uh, read the writer results which are more interesting and uh, first uh, uh, we're going to look into uh, uh, how engine conforms when we uh, increase uh, 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 increase memory size from very small to big and now on uh, 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 initial uh, Samsung 850 consumer grade storage we see actually that uh, now we see a lot of uh, variants in the results, kind of stalls. In the, in the, for uh, wire tiger, you see in some cases actually throughput actually drops uh, 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 to uh, zero. And keep in mind that uh, this is 10 second resolution. That means that for 10 seconds, engine was not able to process uh, any transaction. So, um, and uh, uh, we see uh, uh, also some uh, uh, downs for uh, RobotDB. Uh, uh, I will show some uh, more details uh, later. Uh, uh, but uh, we can see that uh, under multiple threads of workload, uh, uh, RobotDB in this case actually uh, is able to uh, outperform White Tiger, where White Tiger on uh, uh, this uh, uh, storage shows a lot of uh, uh, variability. And again, uh, to kind of to show a uh, summary, uh, and, uh, to show uh, 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 median uh, results, I show this uh, box plot uh, uh, graph. Uh, uh, you can see under multiple threads uh, or plot, uh, wire tiger is not able uh, to keep up with uh, right intensive overload. Uh, is not able to keep up, to keep up with uh, uh, proxy. And but now, uh, as we are going to, to better uh, storage, uh, you can see it's actually better storage uh, helps uh, a lot for uh, wire tiger. We still see a lot of variability, but uh, uh, now it is uh, much less uh, intensive. There is no, not much, actually there is no any drops uh, to zero that uh, uh, storage is able to uh, to handle pressure from a uh, white tiger or uh, white tiger uh, uh, right. So why do you question about this? Yeah. Uh, does that just mean so you have some stalls which I would say 
one side of the left and you and your resolution is not showing that? Or uh, does it still disappear at all? Uh, uh, that's actually, I don't know. Uh, I would need to, to run to rerun re my experiment with one second resolution. Uh, this, this I have done with 10 second resolution. Okay. Uh, I did not see stalls on this okay. resolution. Yeah, and uh, I will repeat uh, those uh, with one second. And this is, if, uh, again, to show uh, some uh, um, box plots, you can see actually the median, median results under multiple threads for plots. Uh, RoxDB is uh, able uh, to perform, to handle uh, more uh, 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 rewrites transaction than uh, white. Uh, now uh, I, I would like to show that uh, I show the results for uh, uh, memory scalability. And now let's look. Uh, uh, let's take a look how Nginx scales with uh, multiple threads. And in this case, uh, I use very big uh, cache size. That means that all data fits into memory. That in this case, data fits into memory, and we use uh, m multiple threads from one to uh, one uh, thousand to see how Nginx performs. In the uh, right case. Uh, so, uh, again, uh, this uh, uh, way uh, uh, initial grade uh, device, Samsung 850, uh, um, uh, we can uh, see that initially uh, White Tiger scales uh, quite well, but then uh, after some point of uh, time, this is like um, uh, uh, 34 threads. We see that uh, uh, results for uh, White Tiger. Uh, drops down, while uh, uh, RoxDB is uh, uh, able to scale, uh, I would say, quite well. There are some uh, problems with uh, RoxDB after 300 threads. I, I, I will uh, explain them a little, a little later. So, um, uh, uh, and uh, 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 RoxDB is able to handle multiple threads up to 300 threads quite well. While uh, white tiger, uh, uh, you see, it uh, uh, drops uh, uh, down. I would say it's signal, signals about some uh, internal contention issue. And if we uh, look and if we try to unfold the case, for example, for 112 threads, that we, we can see how uh, uh, white tiger and the RoxDB performs in these cases. So uh, this uh, uh, results for 112 threads. With, one, uh, with 10 second uh, resolution. We see again that uh, white tiger periodically, and actually this is with a 60 second uh, period, uh, white tiger drops down to zero, while uh, RoxDB performs much uh, stable, but we still see uh, also some drops for uh, 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 RoxDB. Uh, we, we will go to that. So, and uh, uh, this uh, uh, behavior of uh, uh, white tiger, uh, I correspond to this uh, uh, to checkpoint. So, uh, usually for uh, 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 almost uh, uh, all databases write uh, buffering in memory, uh, they're not immediately landed on storage. And uh, in this case, to deal with the crashes, uh, databases perform operations like uh, uh, you might you, you, you might hear uh, uh, Islam mentioned the rider headlock or in my scale it's redo logs or white tiger use uh, uh, journals uh, terminology and uh, to uh, to limit the uh, size of this uh, log file white tiger uh, performs time based checkpoint which you uh, by default is uh, 60 seconds that's why we see uh, those uh, 60 60 seconds, uh, 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 second drop. But uh, in White Tiger, there is uh, this option sync delay, which kind of not o o obvious name what it does, but you can uh, change this uh, checkpoint in interval by playing with the uh, sync uh, delay option. Uh, but also it has a size-based checkpoint. It, it, will, it will perform checkpoint when it reaches two gigabytes of uh, log files, and uh, I'm not sure if you actually can uh, change uh, this parameter. I, I was not uh, able to find it as uh, changeable. Uh, uh, so um, uh, uh, now, uh, if we uh, uh, look into more uh, advanced storage, uh, Samsung 863. 
uh, and again this is a threat uh, scalability that uh, while Tiger uh, still uh, shows this uh, periodical drops, it's not, they're not uh, to zero and uh, after uh, some uh, thread uh, 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 threshold, uh, uh, while Tiger uh, uh, does not uh, scale uh, as well. Uh, but now uh, let's look into uh, uh, RocksDB. Uh, I started to look why uh, 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 RocksDB failed in this case. And uh, uh, it appears that uh, RocksDB is actually quite demanding to open file a limit. If, uh, again, we go back to uh, Islam presentation, you can see that RocksDB uses a lot of uh, files and uh, a lot of levels. So that means uh, that uh, 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 RocksDB might require a lot of uh, open files uh, uh, at the given point of time. And uh, I was not uh, very careful at the initial of my benchmark and I did not set unit properly. So uh, when you use RocksDB, be aware to set up, uh, uh, to, uh, uh, to set up limit of open files uh, high enough. The, the problem is that I actually did not quite found what is uh, what is the proper number uh, should be. So if there uh, any guidance, how many open files we would need that would help to understand how uh, how we can set up uh, that limit. Right? So uh, why, uh, why does it? Well, uh, unfortunately, uh, RocksDB just uh, crashes. It says uh, I don't, I don't, I cannot open uh, any more files. Oh, files. I see. Yeah. So, so it's actually crashed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it crashed. It, it just. Okay, uh, yeah, I wasn't sure what you grabbed. Yeah. yeah. And now, if you show results for uh, high-end, uh, high-end uh, uh, storage. Uh, it's uh, about uh, for the similar uh, results than uh, uh, previous uh, server grade uh, storage. So if we, uh, to summarize uh, all the storage on uh, one chart, we see that actually uh, yeah, uh, low-end storage uh, uh, is not uh, uh, very good for uh, a white tiger, uh, and the white tiger might uh, require uh, some uh, uh, faster or uh, more performance storage. While uh, uh, RocksDB seems kind of indifferent, uh, uh, results for uh, RocksDB almost uh, uh, identical for uh, uh, all, all kind of storage uh, uh, I tested. So uh, conclusions from this uh, experiment, uh, I found that when data fits into memory, uh, 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 RocksDB actually works well even on a, a cheaper storage, but the White Tiger uh, requires uh, storage that uh, can handle a huge volume of work right. And uh, as uh, for uh, final experiment, uh, I uh, uh, will try to uh, talk into uh, thread scalability, but now in IO bound workload, where uh, cache size is actually only 20 gigabytes. That uh, means we to perform operations, we will need to, to perform IO. And uh, uh, this I.O. kind of uh, 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 tricky, this workload uh, characterized by intensive background writes. Again, all writes from database usually uh, comes in background. But so to execute a user query, uh, uh, we will need to perform uh, uh, front-end uh, I.O. reads. And uh, uh, performance actually will depend uh, a lot of uh, uh, storage uh, uh, I.O. Read uh, performance, and uh, mm, uh, 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 this kind of interesting uh, workload for uh, storage because uh, storage vendors uh, don't usually focus on uh, this kind of uh, workloads. It's usually uh, reads uh, or, 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 or writes or bulk reads or bulk bulk writes. But in this case, it's uh, very small reads but a uh, huge volume of, of, of uh, writes to expect uh, from this kind of uh, workload. And uh, 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 yeah, let's see on the uh, uh, first I.O. I.O. bound results again. This is a, a cheap storage, Samsung 850. And the uh, uh, behavior is uh, 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 about the same as we uh, saw previously. That uh, Wire Tiger 
why tiger shows a lot of variability while a ROGB is able to scale better with multiple threads. And if you look into some uh, better storage uh, server grade, okay, so that's again type or that's uh, A363 Samsung. And uh, 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 there, uh, again, we don't see drops uh, to zero from Wild Tiger, but uh, there is still a lot of variability. But at uh, the, the same time, we can see uh, a lot of uh, 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 jumps for uh, uh, ROXDB2. And if we uh, unfold into case with 100, a 12th thread, we can uh, see this kind of behavior. That again, uh, uh, this uh, time, uh, 10 seconds interval resolution, and again we see this uh, uh, 60 seconds interval with a uh, wide tiger uh, checkpoint. Yeah. But we also see uh, 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 some drop for uh, ROXDB, and the I, I could correspond to this to ROXDB compaction process, which uh, Islam uh, mentioned previously. So, it seems uh, when uh, uh, ROXDB has to perform this uh, compaction, it also affects the uh, general performance. It also might result in some uh, background uh, longer performance. Uh, uh, now uh, to, uh, to try to deal with this uh, wire tiger uh, variability, I tried to play with it. Uh, sync uh, delay option is a checkpoint uh, interval. Uh, by default, it's uh, uh, 60 seconds, one minute. And we can uh, increase, uh, in this case, I try to increase to uh, 10 minutes. And you can see it's kind of uh, help. Now, uh, performance is more uniform, but uh, still, uh, you see them. every 10 minutes, it's kind of uh, cardiogram uh, behavior where performance uh, 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 jumps. Uh, 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 top and, and down for a uh, wide target. And then, uh, uh, actually, if you try to uh, s s summarize this uh, uh, throughput, we see that for 60 seconds, actually, a lot of variance, but for uh, uh, 10 minutes, there are a lot of less variance. But actually, it seems that uh, median throughput is actually a, a little worse uh, 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 in this case. But uh, uh, performance is, uh, uh, is, is more stable. Uh, it seems you see in this uh, case uh, uh, the uh, throughput. You see the uh, uh, wire tiger holds the uh, average line. Uh, yeah, how wide is that? Uh, no, actually, I don't have answer on this question. I, I don't need to look more okay. into, uh, into that. Right. And uh, uh, actually, what uh, what we need to keep in mind with this uh, sync delay option is actually uh, because it's a checkpointing process, it will affect uh, crash uh, recovery time. And it seems actually even with default uh, 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 one minute uh, one minute checkpointing. Uh, to start a MongoD, MongoD after crash, it actually took 25 minutes for me. And we, if we increase this uh, parameter to 10 minutes, the uh, crash recovery took uh, uh, 40 minutes. So that's uh, something that you keep in, in mind when you uh, uh, will want to, to change this uh, parameter. And, and now, uh, finally, if we look into high-end storage in uh, IOBA or Cloud, we see actually that uh, Wild Tiger now in this case enjoys uh, a lot and uh, scales uh, much better and shows much better throughput on a uh, high high end uh, storage. Uh, I correspond this uh, to to the fact that uh, Samsung uh, uh, 1725 provides much better I/O uh, response time, and uh, Wild Tiger is able to to utilize it. That uh, uh, we see it. Uh, 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 outperforms uh, ROXDB uh, uh, about twice, but there's still, a lot of, unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, a lot of uh, variance uh, in this case. And if you put uh, all uh, storages uh, together uh, 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 from lower end to higher end, uh, again, it seems uh, that a wild tiger for a wild tiger. Uh, um, 
better storage will be uh, beneficial. Uh, while uh, ROXDB performs uh, about uh, equally uh, for uh, uh, for uh, uh, 863 and uh, 7025. Uh, so uh, that's a storage uh, characteristic something to, to, to have in mind when you uh, design uh, for a uh, wide type. And uh, for uh, my uh, conclusions from this experiment, I would say RockDB works uh, well uh, with uh, cheap storage that we can, uh, uh, we don't, uh, would not need to look into storage upgrade. Uh, white Tiger, if you need to scale White Tiger, White Tiger will benefit from uh, uh, faster storage. And uh, uh, from what I see to, to improve White Tiger performance, Actually, there is a typical recommendation for uh, all B3-based engines that uh, all B3 engines uh, enjoy more memory. So if your data does not fit into memory, more memory will help uh, for B3 storage. And uh, 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 some I.O. with better response time will also help uh, all wide target performance. And uh, playing with uh, checkpoint intervals for white tiger might help with uh, liability, but uh, keep in mind the crash, crash recovery time. And uh, if you want to send me feedback or questions, uh, my uh, contacts slides uh, will be available online. You, you will be able to look into numbers, and uh, yeah. uh, you will be able, able to ask me any questions. So I think this is all from that.